Hi YouTube. We're gonna do a Costco quarantine haul because well, quarantine, we got nothing else to do, so. Okay. I know that you guys are in quarantine because guess what? Everyone's in quarantine. <laughs> so I'm gonna be posting a lot more videos about what, I have no idea, but we're gonna do it. Um, and since this is the first time I've been out of the house and like, I'm just gonna show you what I got at Costco. So let's hop into it. And I'm pretty excited guys, I got a lot of snacks. Woo! Okay, welcome to the vlog. Toby says hi, Coco says hi. No doggies were harmed during the filming of this vlog. Dogs out. Anyways, okay. Um, so this is gonna be a really casual grocery haul video. Sorry. Um, I'm gonna. Sh it's why is it casual? Cause I'm on the floor. Why I'm on the floor? Cause I'm tired from all that shopping. So just roll with it. And a lot of this stuff is heavy. And I just I don't I don't want to take it over there. I'll do it after the video. So. Um, I got a lot of snacks, you guys. I've been snacking like crazy, so let's talk about this. Okay, so I got this thing called Nut Zo. I'm gonna make this nasty, okay? I have plenty of peanut butter in my cabinet. I got this to make cookies out of it. Um, I looked at the macros, eight grams of carbs, six grams of protein, 15 grams of fat, okay? Mama needs that, and it's like vegan and soy-free and a bunch of cool nuts, so. It's like texture, so it's gonna be a really good peanut butter cookie. So I got that. Um, I got pure sea salt. Every household needs it. Let me tell you. Not food related, so we'll save that. I got um, dried apricots because I'm a snacker. I love sugar. And I just kind of need something sweet to munch on or I will overeat. That's what I do. I would rather have a little bit of apricots than four bagels, which did not happen last night. I got myself a big old bag of chia seeds. Kylie, why a big old bag of chia seeds? Great question. It's for chia seed pudding. Oh my God, I love, love, love chia seed pudding. So I just restocked. Up next, I've had these before. These are um, Quaker, or sorry, Quaker, coconut clusters. They're coconut clusters. They're freaking delicious. They got chia seed, sunflower seed, pumpkin seed. Highly, highly, highly recommend. No, don't eat my snacks. Don't eat my snacks. Also in the snacky department, I got crispy cauliflower. So it looks like these are plain flavored. So what I think I'm gonna do is um, mix them with some nutritional yeast. It's like a powder, I think, and it's like, it tastes like cheesy, basically. And I think that'll just make these. I also got as a sweet treat, I told you guys, I've been snacking, man. I need the sweets. This is a honey roasted nut mix. Uh, my grandpa used to get nuts like this, and he would always have like a little bowl in his garage. Um, so these remind me of him in a weird way. I don't know. Um, up next, I got ketchups because we were running low, and I realized we're a ketchup family. We eat a lot of ketchup. Um, okay, I only have a couple more food items, so let's get through these. I was really, really excited. These are some grain free granola bars, they're soy free and grain free. Um, why was I excited? I don't know. I like the packaging and they sounded delicious. Almonds, pecans, maple syrup, honey, coconut, pumpkin seeds, cinnamon, sea salt, and vanilla. There was 16 bars for like 13 bucks. So you do the math. Uh, non-GMO, paleo certified. Hey, I'm trying to do a video here, bro. Up next, we got these, uh, baked seaweed crisps. They're gluten-free, vegan, I don't know. I like seaweed, I like crunchy things. I think I'll like this. Actually, I forgot there's more food and I got a non, I, I'll show you. Hold on. Okay, okay, dokey, already choky. I got ah, a bunch of Beyond Burgers. So there was eight to a package. Oh, wait. Oh, 16. So I actually got a whole lot of Beyond Meat burgers because 
eight. Is there eight? Two, four, six. Eight. Okay, so I got 16 patties. Um, these were on sale for a really, really good price. Uh, burgers, I love them, so we're stocked. <laughs> Up next, I got um, a low fat organic Greek yogurt. I personally don't do dairy, but Brendan lives. I live with Brendan, so he'll have this, and I want to make him some Herbalife donuts, and in that recipe, you need some of this, so it's perfect. I want to chef him up some Herbalife protein donuts. Um, I got myself, because Brendan will not touch this, it's organic rice cauliflower. It's one, one really big bag. I love rice cauliflower. I love rice, all right? And if we can make rice not make me feel guilty for eating it i'm about it so yeah rice cauliflower is the way to go um this is a brendan item he likes his naked green juice i bought this fat thing of garlic because we needed enough well we had two so we had two and they were really expensive and cute like the small jars you know and like the best quality garlic stuff and then brendan left them on the counter yes babe calling you out so I just got one big one. We'll see how it tastes. I haven't personally bought this, but I love garlic and I put it on everything, so we can definitely use this. Um, the last food item, ugh, I'm a little disappointed about. So the whole reason I went to Costco anyways was for their olive oil. This is what it looks like now. Same label, but it was clear. I'm just so disappointed because it looks ugly. It used to be a lot prettier. <laughs> I don't know. It just makes it look like cheap. I don't know. Maybe I'm being a label. I don't know. So, I got that cheap looking olive oil. So, up next, these items are food items, but they're pretty important in our household. Um, Zyrtec, hello. Allergy season, baby. Um, I also got sunscreen, and so summer is nine, nine weeks away, okay guys? So I gotta tell ya, um, if you're gonna buy sunscreen, you wanna buy the Reef Friendly Sunscreen, okay? Reef Friendly Sunscreen, Reef Friendly Sunscreen, Reef Friendly Sunscreen. Um, to save the fishies, man. Um, I got the 50 SPF because Brendan is got some Irish okay um, and we do use sunscreen like crazy uh, so a two-pack we're gonna go through this in a summer it's gonna be okay and plus if we're still stuck at home this summer I'm gonna be outside a whole lot so we'll both use it it's, it's gonna be great I bought um, this thing of one gal bags I like to meal prep or honestly just like organizing around the house I do use one gallon bags I don't know, man. I just do. I got woo, a whole lot of clothes soap. This one's um, plant-based. How do they make it plant-based? I don't know, but they did. So it's a really big one. Um, I got the dog's dog food. Um, this is actually Trader Joe's. It's the holistic natural. It's got vitamins, omega-3. I actually have never used this brand prior with my pets, so if this is a really good brand or a really bad brand, let me know below. Second to last thing, trash bags. I don't know why, I like the flexi ones and I like them lightly scented, so that's what I got. Kind of weird to have a garbage bag preference, but whatever. And the piece of resistance. I had a quarantine birthday, so you know what? I get to use that card, the like, it's my birthday present, even if it's not my birthday. That is the rules. I've made them, and that is what's happening. So, this is what I got for my birthday present. <laughs> it's a cooler! I got a cooler. It looks really big in this video. I promise it's not. But it's got lots of space. enough of that. So anyways guys, um, yeah, I broke quarantine to go to Costco and this was my haul. See you next time.